Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Greetings, Pine Richland. I'm Noah. Today is April 8th, 2021, and it's an A day. And I'm the baby in person with the AK group. Now let us go into today's announcements. Sash, yesterday was our Teal Out Action Day, sponsored by the Students Against Sexual Harassment Club to support one in three women and one in four men who experience sexual violence in their lifetime. Teaching people about consent and understanding boundaries is important. But in order to fully stop sexual harassment, assault, and dating violence requires a social change. Too often, the shame of sexual assault and dating violence rests with the victims. Until that view changes, sexual assault will continue to go unpunished and the victims won't get justice. If you were on a virtual model yesterday and you'd like to wear a teal ribbon as a symbol of your pledge to be a part of this social change and break the cycle of teen dating violence and sexual misconduct, please ask your first period teacher for a ribbon. PRTV Club, that's us. The next meeting for the PRTV Club will take place Thursday, April 15th, after school beginning 3.15 p.m. The meeting will be held virtually. Go to the Google Classroom link found at the bottom of the screen to join the meeting. New members are always welcome to join. Planning for this year's Rammies Film Festival will be part of the meeting's agenda. Financial Literacy Month. Did you know that April is Financial Literacy Month? Each day this month, we'll have a, we're going to share a cool financial fact that has been provided by the business department. They know how to business. Here's today's fact. Did you know that the higher credit score, the better chance of a lower APR on your loans? I'm sure that all of us know what that means. Okay, fact of the day time. Let's check with James for the fact of the day. I'm James, back with the fact. Um, did you know Obama didn't like ice cream till he started working at his first job at Baskin Robbins? Neither did I. It's pretty facty fun. Back to the studio. Very fun. Fact. What a cool fact about Obama. That's insane. Forensics. Members of the Pine Richland Forensics team took home several awards following a virtual tournament held before a break by Seton LaSalle High School. Montavu Vaisht took the second place award in extemporaneous speaking, while Yasha and Matthew Anderson took fifth and sixth, respectively in the same event. Also earning awards were Priya Shah, third in poetry, and John Varghese, fifth in Lincoln-Douglas debate. Congratulations to all who competed. Blood Drive. Please sign up to save a life and help PR students reach their goal of 50 donors for the upcoming scholarship Blood Drive. Donations are needed now more than ever and will help PRHS earn valuable scholarship funds. The event is being held on Sunday, April 18th at the Vitalance North Hills Donor Center. Go to the district website and click on Headlines and Features to find the PRHS Scholarship Blood Drive link to sign up. Yearbook. The window to order your yearbook online is closed. You can still order a yearbook for $70 to the end of April. The price increases in May. Mail to PRHS or drop off your $70 check in room 221. Checks should be made payable to PRHS yearbook. Theme day Thursday. This week's theme is Mix Match Pattern Colors Day. Remember, if you participate in the week's theme, you will be entered to become the Ramsway Student of the Week. Next week's theme day Thursday theme is Workout Gear Day. Prof. This year, the Pine Ridge Opportunities Fund plans to award 19 scholarships to Pine Ridge High School seniors. Scholarship applications are available and due by this coming Friday. 
Descriptions of the current scholarships can be found on their website, which can be found at the bottom of your screen. All right, let's send it over to James for today's feature. What's up, PR? I'm James with the feature today. Um, what's your name? Uh, Roman Dunlap. That, that's a great name, Roman. Um, uh, what's your favorite Italian food? Uh, I got to go with uh, Calzone for Justin Dietz. That's a good one. And who's your favorite teacher? Um, I'd say Mr. Cyber and Workmeister. Great track coaches, too. Okay, okay. Um, and, and what's your favorite class? Um, lunch. Lunch? Yeah. That's a great yeah, one. one I can pass. Okay, okay. Um, do you think COVID's real? Uh, maybe. All right, I agree. Back to the studio. That was a great feature. Yeah, best interview I have ever seen. Guidance News. The following scholarships, contests, and workshops are now available. Stop in the guidance office or check on Navion's on a college tab scholarship list. Now let's go to Noah, that's this guy, for our PRTV Sports Report. All right, Pine Rachel, I'm here with your sports. Girls Golf, PRHS Girls Golf is actively seeking new golfers for the upcoming fall season. There is an invitational meeting this Thursday at 7 p.m. via the Google Meet link found at the bottom of your screen. Parents and players of all skill levels are welcome to attend. If you have any questions, please contact head coach Mr. Slim at the email address also found at the bottom of your screen. Boys Tennis. This past Wednesday, the varsity team defeated Swickley Academy 3-2. Their next match is this Friday at home against Upper St. Clair. In other boys' tennis news, good luck to the members of the team competing in their Whitfield section. Singles tournament being held today at North Allegheny Senior High School. Girls Lacrosse. Today the varsity team will be at Swickley Academy. Game time is at 4.30 p.m. Boys Volleyball. Tonight the varsity and JV teams will take on Peters Township at home. JV plays at 6 p.m., followed by the varsity game at 7.30 p.m. That's all from me. Let's go back to the main desk. What a great sports report. I'm a great announcer. Yeah, whoever that guy was, he was pretty good at what he does. <laughs> now let's go to James for the lunch. Yep. Hi, I'm James with the lunch. Um, today we got pasta bar, cheeseburger, chicken filet, Daily pizza choice, Bosco sticks with sauce, italics hoggy, turkey bacon cheese sub, and our daily entree salad choice. Uh, bye. Mmm, tasty. Yummy, yummy in my tummy. Chew and swallow in your tummy. Now, let's go to me for weather. What it is, Pine Richland, it's me again, the infant, with your weather report. So today, we got a high of 78 and a low of 53, and it's going to be partly cloudy. It's like that almost every day. And tomorrow is going to be 73 with a high and a low of 53. It's going to rain. We have rain on Sunday, partly cloudy the rest of the week, and it's going to be pretty warm. Lots of 60s. That's all there is to say about that. Let's go back to the main desk. That's some nice weather out there. Yeah, what a great weather guy. 
Senior Spotlight. Starting today and continuing through the end of the school year, we will conclude the morning announcements with a segment called the Senior Spotlight. This segment will feature one of our seniors each day, 10 of our seniors each day, not one. Here are the first 10. Well, that's all for today. I'm the infant child, and it's an A day. And I'm Noah, in person with the L to Z group. Bye bye! Bye, Pine Richland. Bye. Out living goal, number 35, adding her up.
Rams goal number three, Haley Albright. Number 35, Caroline Gentilly.
goal, number six, Mia Pepsi.
not limited goal number twenty five, bridie kane.